Hello, algebra students, Mr. Lawrence here, and this video is brought to you once again by Sneeze Free Productions. Anyway, here we go. We're doing another video. Remember, you got to take notes with this. You got to pause it, maybe replay part of it. If you don't understand, come and ask me a question about it, right? Okay, so here we go. I'm going to look for the nth term. This one's all about cubic patterns, and so I'm going to make an input-output table. Now, those of you who are absent on Friday, you missed some stuff. Hey, by the way, almost all of you worked really well, and you, you did your best, and you were trying. There are some of you who are kind of like, you have this almost attitude about, like, like it doesn't matter, and you don't have to, you know, you're just kind of there to, to tell a joke or to screw around. i got to tell you, the classmates that are taking it serious are going to blow way by you, and you probably won't be staying in honors because you're not showing me the, uh, the gumption that you want to be there. You know, it's not a special privilege for you to be in honors. You've been chosen because of ability, but if you're not going to perform, then certainly will will not keep you in that, in that level because your grade will just continually drop. Anyway, let's get on with this one. All right, we're going to find the first difference. I got plus 14. I got, oh... 13 will be 40, and so I think it's going to be 38, right? Does that look right? 38, yeah, that does look right. Okay, 53, 127 minus 53. I think it's going to be 74. Well, this is definitely not a linear pattern. And then finally, 127, 249 minus 127 is going to be 122. All right, so it's definitely not linear. I'm going to go to the second level. And let's see, that's going to be, what, 24? And 78, 38 would be 40. I'm going to be taking away 4. That would be 36. And then 122 minus 74. Get do a little barrow. It looks like I'm going to get 48. Mm, definitely not quadratic. Let's try the third differences and see what happens. Oh, it looks like that's plus 12. And it looks like that's also plus 12. Hey, the third differences match. That forces this to be a cubic pattern, right? Don't you ever erase work. I'm just doing it because of my workspace. Okay, I always want to see what you're thinking. So this is a cubic pattern. It's going to be something like n cubed. All right. Now, remember in the quadratics... We had to divide this third difference by 2, but here we're going to divide by 6. Yeah, we're going to divide them by 6. We're going to get 12 divided by 6 n cubed, which of course is 2 n cubed. Why 6? Well, it's the division of 2 from the previous level uh, times the fact that we're on the third level. Now, again, I don't ever want you to erase work like I'm doing right now. I'm just doing it so that we can see things better. Okay, and so I erased too much there, didn't I? All right, let's get that back in there. All right, now I'm going to do my comparison line. I'm going to um, put 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 in for n into n cubed, and I'll write their answers there. Now, remember, you got to pay attention to your of operations. So let's see, I'm going to have 2 times 1 cubed. That is not 8. That is 2, right? 1 cubed times 2. And then I've got to put a 2 in here. All right, that's 8 times 2 is 16. I like that. See how the numbers are, are looking close to those numbers? Yeah, I think I'm doing this right. All right, and next I'm going to put a 3 in. And 3 cubed, oh, there goes my hand break going off, getting all these videos ready for you, ladies and gentlemen. All right, 3 cubed is 27, times 2 is 54. You know what? I don't think I have to do all the other ones. I think I see the pattern. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to take one away, turn the green ones into the black ones. So my answer, my nth term, is going to be 2n cubed, take away 1. There you go. All right, here's one for you to try, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, don't just... Um, watch these videos like you're watching TV and you can't remember what you saw half an hour later. 
Make sure you're following along, you're taking notes, you're pausing, you're rewinding, whatever you need to do to be successful. You go ahead and do it. All right, so if you haven't tried this one, please pause the video and try it. And here comes my solution. Da -da -da -da. This one will be n cubed minus 4. All right. By the way, if you went down to the fourth differences, we learned that you would have to divide by 24, right? Fifth difference is 120. All right. If you don't understand that or don't remember it or were absent and would like me to explain more, oh, pardon me, it's getting late. It's 9.33. It's past my bedtime. Good thing we get an extra hour of sleep tonight. Anyway, if you'd like me to explain more, please come and see me. All right. That's it for the video. Mr. Lawrence signing off. Have a good night, everybody.